Karen, now go inside and get warm. As we know, though, the usually the east side sees more snow when it comes to that lake effect, and that was certainly the case today. Our Brittany Weir is live in Mayfield Heights. So, Brittany, how are the roads looking out there? They look pretty clear, at least behind you. Yeah, even though the east side usually gets the most snow and got a lot with this storm, as you just said, the roads are looking pretty good, but they're still pretty slick. So if you're heading out, make sure to drive slow. As you can see, we are right here off of uh, Wilson Mills Road, right outside the high school here. And things, again, looking pretty good. People traveling at a good rate. But the high schools, all the schools, they were closed today. So students, they got to enjoy a snow day. We have seen a number of plows out all day treating the roads. We stopped by Home Depot and spoke to people picking up supplies for the storm. They told me some roads are better than others. It just depended on which towns you were driving through. You could tell definitely when you were traveling between uh, Cleveland Heights and South Euclid. You could tell the roads all of a sudden uh, got much clearer in South Euclid. So gotcha. Cleveland Heights has to step it up just a little bit. Ruth, her husband, and their pup Chloe were out picking up rock salt. You got to pick it up early before it um, uh, gets sold out. Ruth volunteers at a food center and said she had fewer people come in than usual because of the snow. And that snow keeping a lot of people uh, inside today because it's brutally cold. But uh, Roots Dog Chloe, they said she loves the snow. Can't wait to get home and go play in it. So if you're you're heading home, you're heading out on the roads, again, the number one rule is always make sure to give yourself extra time. We were driving around some main roads, 271 earlier. Conditions, they were pretty good. But if your commute or your drive today involves those back roads, that's really where you're going to watch and want to watch it because that's where we saw some of that ice and that slush building up. But we'll have more coming up in the 4 o'clock hour, live in Mayfield Heights. Brittany Weir, 19 News. All right, Brittany, thank you. Let's take a look at our poll right now. Most of you giving your area a grade of F as 64% of you when it comes to clearing the streets. You can still take part in our poll. Head to cleveland19.com vote. We'll have those results for you throughout the afternoon.